Welcome back to Ozark's Fox A, and we are so excited to welcome the Peak family. Now, these are triplets right here. I've never seen triplets in real life. And they're right here. This is Jonathan, Travis, and Hannah Peak, and their dad, Shane Peak, and they are all archers. Now, when I think of archery, I think that is something that sounds difficult and very hard to do, and so I've never even attempted it. But Shane, you were telling me before the show, it's something that anybody can learn and be trained, and you're also the coach at Pershing Middle School. That is So correct. you coach archery every day, all day long, to middle schoolers. Yes, for is four it challenging? years. For four it, years. It is, and, and as you alluded to, the cool thing is everybody can do it. Uh, it's a sport that anybody can show up without any experience and have success at. So what's the skill level, though? Like, what do you have to be able to do to, to do archery? Like, perfect 20-20 okay. vision? I don't no, know. No, if you can walk in and hold a bow and pull the string, mm -hmm. you can shoot archery. Okay, tell me this. When you pull it back and you're looking, are you looking at the arrow, the tip of the arrow? Are you looking at the bullseye? What is your goal when you're looking as you pull it back? All right, with our archery arrows, we have no sights, so we do use uh, the arrow, and we put the tip of the arrow on the target. Okay. And so... Do you use lasers at all? We do not use lasers. Is that a dumb nope. question, guys? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Jonathan's like, yes, it is. Because <laughs> I didn't know if maybe if you had a laser and it could point to the target, it would be helpful. That would make it easier. You know, like on a rifle, maybe. Yeah. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just uh. saying. Uh, so, triplets. Hannah, Jonathan, Travis. Let's start with you, Hannah. Hannah, when you, when, how old were you when you started, and how did you know you liked it? Well, I was in sixth grade. Actually, no, no, just kidding. I was in seventh grade, and I started, Dad was the coach, and so it was just something fun I could do with friends. And then we went, and I started getting better and better, so then it got more fun as I got to go to state, um, eighth grade year. So mm -hmm. I just kept How'd going. How'd you do it at state? Um, I don't know. It was not my best, but it was a lot of fun, and we got to go to, like, the Branson Landing and stuff. Oh, that's so, fun. Yeah. I, now, the first time you ever picked it up and you shot it, mm -hmm. did you hit the target? <laughs> No. Okay, good. That's what, that would be me, Hannah, so I don't feel as bad. And now you're like so high up in the state and you're going to states this weekend. That's impressive. Okay, Jonathan, tell me about your first time picking up the bow. Um, well, I pretty much hit the target every time. So. No, I'm, oh, I'm just kidding. Boom. I'm just kidding. Oh, look at that. Is there any sibling rivalry? Um, yeah, With me and Travis. Sure. But, yeah, between the brothers, I bet. Yeah. <laughs> so you picked it up right away and you liked it? Um, yeah, I was, I was a natural. No. <laughs> Guy. So you have to have confidence, and he has confidence, because mm -hmm. you have state this weekend. You need to build that up. Okay, Travis, what about you? First time picking it up. Uh, obviously, it was very hard. So like, I struggled <laughs> and missed a target probably a couple times. But then you get better. It's the kind of sport where you just have to practice. Like, and when you practice, what do you skill. have to do to practice? Is it is it just repetition and looking yeah. at the target? Mus forming the muscle memory and like hitting the target over and over and knowing where you're aiming and hitting over and over and just the practice of repetition, getting that muscle memory down is what like gets you better. Wow. Is axe throwing similar? Could I practice axe throwing and then do bow? <laughs> probably. It's okay, probably thank similar. you. I've axe thrown before. That's good. Yeah. Shane, now coming up this weekend, starting tomorrow through Saturday at uh, in Branson, you have state coming up? Yes. What yes. can people expect? And it's open to the public, by the way. Yes, we have the state tournament in Branson. We have several schools in Springfield that will be representing uh, the area, and it's just a lot of fun. Uh, Bass Pro is a big sponsor, and they come down and, and put on a, a great show. And it's at the Branson uh, Convention Center, and it does last all day. When can people come? Yeah, uh, they, all day on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Uh, mm -hmm. There will be kids shooting from all over the state. And now, what day are you guys shooting? We're on Friday. Friday. Yes. Tell me about this process, because I've, I've been in competitions before. Knowing the stakes are high, what is it like the night before sleeping? And when you get there, are you so nervous going up for that first time, Hannah? Um, well, I'm kind of a nervous talker, so I just like that all my friends are around me, so like, even like when we are shooting, I'm still like talking to them. So, so you like, talk when you're nervous? Yes. <laughs> Perfect. We'll know if Hannah's nervous that day if she's talking a lot. Jonathan, yeah. Travis? I'm kind of the opposite. So I like, I'm more quiet and like, mm -hmm. so everybody's different. Whenever, so like whenever we go to the state tournament, everyone's really nervous. And like it's harder to shoot under nerves and pressure. Yeah, because this is the this is state. Yeah, because your like time. knees are shaking and your hands shaking, but you just like everybody handles it differently. It's kind of funny. Like some people are really quiet, some people talk a lot. Mm. But okay, so talker, quiet, confident boy. What about you? In between. You? In between. <laughs> I wish you guys the best of luck. So Shane, you're you're the coach at Pershing Middle School. Mm -hmm. What we've asked is when the weather gets a little better, would you mind coming and bringing, of course, the triplets and yourself, and maybe teaching me and Kelly to shoot outside, and we can just we can have a little competition. That would the be peaks great. Versus Ozarks Fox AM. Okay, that will t we'll, we'll take you on. I'm looking at he's. I can tell you're nervous, Jonathan. <laughs> <laughs> <You're>, <laughs> he's like, no, not really, not at all. Yeah. Again, uh, the state competition starts tomorrow in Branson at the convention center all weekend. 
Seriously, guys, best of luck. I hope you win big time. All three of you, congratulations. And please, awesome. we want you to come back as soon as we can for the weather. Absolutely. We're ready. Guys, please do not go anywhere because up next, Kelly is making green eggs and ham for St. Patrick's Day. You know, we're making that. Coming up next. Thanks, guys, so much. That was Thank fun. You. Oh, my gosh. I can't wait to